everyone, Karen in here from the Cut at Home Design Team. Today I'm going to show you a mini album that I made uh, using Graphic 45 papers. Um, I used the 6x6 patterns and solids from Voyage Beneath the Sea and also Voyage Beneath the Sea in the 8x8. Eight eight. Um, and I just want to show you some of these papers. I just love them. I love Graphic 45 style. I love the vibrant colors. I love that there's so many options to make with these beautiful papers. And so let me show you what I did. Um, I had purchased the mini album itself um, on a scrapbook deals website. Um, and it's just basically an, you know, one that you can like set on the desk kind of thing. Um, an accordion, I guess is what they're called. Um, my husband and I are boaters. And while a voyage beneath the sea would not be good when you're a boater, um, I thought that the papers would be perfect to do a mini album showing some of our pictures. So, so this is a slot for a picture. We've recently gotten a new boat. Um, and so I'm saving that for when we get finally get a picture of it. Um, and I just fussy cut this out. I had a flower die and added flowers to each of the pages. And I had been given this lace and... Um, I also added some lace to each of the pages, so let me just turn it here. Um, this mini album came with a little pocket, and I love this sentiment. It says, my soul is full of longing for the secret of the sea, and the heart of the great ocean sends a thrilling pulse through me. Um, definitely one that fits my husband. Um, when we are out on our boat, um, we sometimes get to make the drawbridges open because it's too tall to get underneath the bridge, and... So you'll see that I have lots of bridge pictures. Um, and this side, there's another pocket with pictures of my husband and I. It says, I love you more than all the fish in the sea. I'm not sure my husband would say that if the fish in the sea were on the end of his fishing pole, but you know. Um, more flowers and more lace. This is a die from Memory Box that is waves. I thought that was pretty cute. Cut a little border out on that one. Um, again, more pictures of bridges. Yes, I'm a little obsessed with bridges. I added some of the lace here and here. Another die from Memory Box that sort of looks like bubbles. Um, and more bubbles over here. Another border. Um, and again, this is a picture, this gorgeous picture of a uh, day when we, were, when we were out on the Sacramento River. Um, a friend of ours who is just a riot. A um, little tag for him there, posing being funny. This is Emily a Mermaid, another one of the uh, panels I fussy cut from the Graphic 45 paper. And then on the back, there's um, more. Um, I cut out this little dude in our, who's riding a fish. Um, thought he was pretty cute. Voyage Beneath the Sea. Um, there's a picture of my husband and I um, just on the bridge of our new boat. Um, this panel was just one that I just cut out and glued on. I love her, little octopus legs. Um, this is one of our sons, and again, another mermaid I fussy cut out, some more lace. Um, I think there's lace on every page. Um, and then the back, lo and behold, another bridge picture. I had run short on lace, so I just add a little bit to this page. Um, and so this mini album will end up on my desk, basically opened up like this to remind me of why I go to work every day. <laughs> well, thank you for watching today. I hope you enjoyed my video. Um, for more information on the products that I used and for more crafty inspiration, be sure to check out the Cut at Home blog at www.cutathome.com slash blog. Stay crafty.